way, man. And um, you know, make sure we get you out there with that. Um, I, I know some folks off of Street Radio who's doing some things. Um, and that day out there in St. Louis, and I know they're gonna. They actually just announced that they're gonna be doing some stuff out there. They got they got a stage. Um, they're gonna be doing something uh, for this up and coming event for that as well. For you know that you know. So let's see what it does hey. for that. Do you do you, do, um, you go to uh, like the Cali or anything like that? You, you you go over there and or like Arizona or I go everywhere I want it. G, you know what I mean? Okay. We yeah, go, we go. We can go to, to the Mediterranean. We can go to the Bahamas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's one thing. See, you know what it is. You know, for your demographics and stuff like that. You know, people picking it up, man. Because you know, having like thirty thousand streams for a track like that, that's 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 very good, especially on a independent scene. You know what I mean? Uh, how do your fans? Uh, how do they receive you when you on stage? Man? Like, let's know about that. Everybody get crazy. That's why I love it. That's why I can't wait to perform again. Like, it's crazy. Everybody's involved, and how I deliver the show is just organic and it's classic, and it's, it's what music is made of. You can't just right. put on a show and just play music. You know what I'm saying? You gotta, right. you know what I'm saying? You gotta be engaged with the audience. You know. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, it's you not. Know. It's not just. Yeah. It's not just a music show. You know, it's, it's not just a music show. It's a. It's a show as well. You know, so you know, you gotta mm-hmm. feel that duty as not only an artist but an entertainer. You know, right. Having that that presence out there, yeah, all, all the way, yeah. And, and like you said, engaging your audience, stuff like that, and your interactive. Um, now you don't you don't use those. Uh, what do you call them? Like the. Uh, but a lot of people use backing tracks. But do you just like rock off the beat without no no. Uh, no, no lip syncing, no, no, no stuff like that. Oh yeah, all my stuff is like pure vocals. Yeah. The only thing in the background may be the ad libs. The ad libs, right, right. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, That's amazing. Them, yeah, give them the deal. Yeah. Give them the real deal. No doubt about it, man. Yeah, man. So, so what's going on? What's going on at the out there in Houston? What's the scene? What's going on out there? You got some shows popping up out there. Anything? Anybody like trying to holler at you? Just do some performances out that way. Um, no, nah, but Houston, Houston Choir right now, we just had, um, we just had some people come down here, like, the NBA, play league, mm-hmm. but they went down here doing these shows, you know. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we gotta make that change up, man. I know some of the folks that's listening in right now. I actually, um, was on the phone with, uh, Grandmaster Flash, we had LL Cool J, uh, uh, um, and the folks from Dog Town, they all chopped it up with this, and they want to know what's really good with like the, the different cities and states and, and who got the you know who's really showing up, like you know. And it's like what we're doing for this year is mean, a different thing where we're going to actually take the artist's music and say, okay, we're not going to run it through those channels, we're going to give it directly to them and say, hey, this is how you get in touch with them, get them on these stages with them, you know, what I'm saying with their, their right. tours, what they're doing. You know what I mean? Because right. it's, it's, it's overdue, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's overdue for them to be like, okay, you know, go through all of these little doors and all that kind of stuff to try to get get an art out there and give them the regular remote. And then, no, like, just give them, say, hey, it's a yay or a nay. Like, look, yes or no. Right. You want to put them on this thing or not? He, he got it. You know what I'm saying? This is his numbers. Run with that. He got the demographics. Run with that. That's that's where it's at. That's a, fact. a lot of people don't believe mm-hmm. that, though, but as soon as they hear my music, they get the, they get the confusion face. Like they ain't like they ain't seen the ghost when I do. Right, right. This boom track got that man. Plus the move got it too, man. Like it, it's dope, man. Like like I'm listening to how the way you're doing your flow. And when I get music that comes from the Southwest, I'm thinking, well, you know, it's more like you know, it's it, it, you know the flavor, like you know, well, it's like the the swagger, you know what I mean? But you like you know, actually out there yeah, like hard, yeah. It's all about yeah. that, man. It's, it's that. I'm I'm coming for next. That's, that's right, right. <laughs> give it to him, man. No doubt about it. Man. Yeah, man. So, what can we expect this video to come out for this track? Boom. Um, probably this summer. Probably more to this summer. Also, a uh, video for a new song called "On the Rock and the Way." So, y'all stay tuned for that as well. All right. Yeah, definitely do that, man. So, when that uh, drops, man, like let us know so we can cop that joint and uh, download it. We actually do some things with uh, um, One Love, One TV, a station right now out there in Chicago. 
Um, I just spoke to them, we spoke up there, uh, April Whitaker, and she's doing some some really big things for 2020 to help artists get their videos out there in a big way. Let me have it on Roku and, and all these different, uh, you know, uh, television stations that they're working with and different, um, you know, like mediums, you know, so you can maybe, you know, get your music out there and, and get it heard. Because, you know, it ain't just like the, the one entity no more that just controls, you know, these things. Like yeah, people using right. YouTube, you know what I mean? You can put it anywhere you want to. Um, I'll say you right here on Renegade Video, we had over 40 million views last year. And we try to double that, you know what I mean, again, you know what I mean? So that's like, you know, we get that 80 million. We only get the sponsorship and stuff like that. So we rock these joints. When we get these artists on this show that, that that's being interviewed and playing their music, it's being heard for sure. You know what I mean? And, and what we like to do when people give us like the feedback, that's what's like, okay, well, this is what we, let's get into their management, their artists, or to the artists, let them know this song is doing this. And we don't have nothing, nothing to hide about that, you know. And that's why we keep it so raw, you know, because we we are renegades against the system of what they way they try to take everybody through a protocol. If your if your music is hot, you know what I mean? Like let it be played, let it be heard. Yeah, bro. You know I mean? Whoever's gonna listen to it, whoever's gonna pick it up, is gonna be forward. You know? Right. That's how you know. That's how. That's the old school way of breaking a record, man. It's like, look, let the people decide for that. Don't. Don't have all the exactly yeah, 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 the end of the day, it's the people's business. There's nothing to be able to do about that. Yeah, that's right. That's the thing that's right. Let the people decide what it is. Don't let these executives try to tell you what they think it is. They over there trying to crunch numbers and, and, and go through their little... You know, we ain't about that. Like, you know, no, that's all they're doing, right? Or so get it on the radio, and, and that's where it's at. So we definitely appreciate the people who definitely support what you're doing. Like, you'll support it when you're out there, man. Do remember Ween, man, doing his thing. Go out there to the SoundCloud.com, all right? Ween the Dream. Go do that right now. Download the track. You say go to Instagram. Is it on the song, Boom? Is it on the uh, the, the other, uh, like, iTunes or, like, uh, Google Play? Or where can they pick it up at? Oh yeah, Boom is also um, on Greenland, and we're about to put it out on Apple Music and iTunes soon. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, man, you're doing your thing, man. Now, do you guys got a treatment for for the video, for idea for the video, or are you just like kind of like waiting for like you know until that time? Yeah, we're getting everything gathered up because we want this video to be. Yeah, we want this video to boom. You feel me? So, you know, mm-hmm. we to, a lot of work going into it. Um, a lot of theatrical, you know, mm-hmm. a lot of, a lot of movie-like scenes, you know, we're just getting that together. But, of course, of course, we got some jam-packed for y'all. You know? yes. <laughs> yeah, give it to No doubt, no doubt about it, man. Yeah, just, I, I really love your flow, man, and when you're doing it, man. Like, now, the concept behind Boom, like, what gave you, like, the, the idea for that, for this, for this track right here, like, like, the name for the title? Uh, when okay when I said what I said about the track and what it meant people just played it and then afterwards it was just an expression of like a bomb blew up in the room like it was like oh my god like bro right and like people around me was like yo this booming this booming this booming and the bass was beating so hard you know it was it was crazy so I had to you know I had to had to make that the boom track you know? Right, no doubt. I mean, it, it's definitely though. I get it. I I just want the people to hear that because I, I got that. You know what I mean? I was like, I'm hearing the bars. I'm like, okay, all right. You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's an exclamation point. You know what I mean? Like, boom. That, you know what I mean? That, you know what I mean? Yeah. No doubt about it, man. That that's just really good. Yeah, man. So I mean, now I, I know I asked you, but is this on an up and coming project, like a like a, a EP, or is it coming out for an album, or is it just a single right here? Yeah, um, that that one and on the rocks that I'm planning on dropping soon. Uh, those are all separate singles, but we got some stuff in the works for um, a single project. All right. And now, are you working with a label or are you with a uh, management? I know you with the PR company, the Starlight, but um, right. are you with a, with a label or are you working with a, a management team, anything like that? Oh, no, I'll say anything. All right. So, when somebody wanted to book you or want to get at you, how can they do that? Oh, yeah, you just hit my email, uh, Reem, under, uh, no, Reem Music, all caps, uh, music spelled with a Z. 
So that'd be ring music at gmail.com. Yeah. Yeah. I'll let you right. boy. We're gonna rock yeah, out. Do that. Yeah. Ring underscore music at gmail.com. No, 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 no underscore. Just ring music, all caps. Okay. All right. Yeah, all right. Yeah, do that, y'all. Ring music uh, at gmail.com. You know what I mean? Come get some that as well. All caps. You know what I mean? Though, oh, actually, too, check out some of the work that out there put out there at soundcloud.com slash wing the dream or to instagram.com slash wing underscore music. You can spell A Z U Z I C. Also on twitter.com slash wing underscore music. You know what I'm saying? It's all in caps as well, man. Come get some of that, man. And like I said, we got other good joints, man. That joint move is definitely a banger, man. But this joint boom right here, this is the one going to turn it up, man, for y'all right here. You already know. You already know. Hey, both sides of that, man. And let them know. Let them know. He, got, he got the bar. That's the thing, because that's what I think that we're hip hop to. People ask me these questions about that when I say, What's, what's up for the you know the new decade in 2020? I say that it's going to go back to more of lyricism than compared to just like seeing whatever that, that feels good for the beat. You know what I mean? No, this is yeah. like you know what I mean. It's like it's, it's thought out. It's like you know start to make people think again. You know when it comes to a song because because now it is. I think a lot of people think that they can just get in the booth and do whatever, and then it's going to be some sort of a hit. And that's what's going to happen. Yeah, but yeah, that's, 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 that's extremely big, rare. You know. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we, we got them. So I, I actually did it other two like the past twenty years of, of music. And I was doing that for the new year. I was I do something like that ten years, twenty years. But I was like, let me go back twenty years or listen to some of the music that's happening. You know what I mean? And and I'm like, yo, some of these joints were super hot in 2000, 2001. You know right. what I mean? Like, you know what I mean? These were right. body bangers. These were body bangers. Get your get your body bag and just start to put them all in me. You know what yo, I mean? Yo, put a zip them up. <laughs> zip them up. <laughs> and then, you know what I'm saying? 2010 came along. I'm like, what's going on here? You know? And I'm like, Wow. The, the flavor of rap just kept getting diluted and diluted and I'm like oh man come on gotta get back to the roots get back to the roots mm-hmm sure did man so then after that you know you know so I now I'm starting to hear artists like it's, it's not really far and few between but it's just what the what the industry did to try to control what what type of music people they thought that people would, would like you know so they got some joints in there but they're not classics and what you're bringing back right. to the industry right now is classic type of hip hop, man. That's what I'm saying. So, once you guys go out there and cop this joint, boom, man. Do remember, Reem the Dream, man. He's doing his thing, man. Come get some out of the game, man. You got any shout outs, brother? Uh, shout out Kalani on the beat. Shout out Starlight PR. Um, you know, we ain't get at me. I want to shout out myself because I'm doing my thing, thing. Do it. Yeah. You know. You know, shout out Renegade Radio, you know, holding it down for Boy Ring. Appreciate y'all for right. Yeah, man. We're going to definitely rock your joint right here. Boom. Also, we're going to give you guys that throwback as well, man. Let's say it's still a new official, man. It's official toilet tissue right there, man. You got that joint. Boom. And also, you got the joint move, man. And then anything else you got, man, please send it over. You know what I'm saying? So we can rock those as well, man. Any mixtapes, we tell you guys to go to SoundCloud.com. Check that out as well. Uh, SoundCloud.com slash Ween the Dream. Also, hit him up on Instagram.com slash dream underscore music, all right? M-U-Z-I-C, okay? Also, on Twitter.com, follow him on as, as well as dream underscore music. Come get some of that all caps, all right? And when the joint drops there on, on all the other uh, of the stream stations, you guys go out there and get that as well, man. We're looking forward to getting that. Yeah. Right? You already know. We're going to turn this one up right here, man. Yeah, come get some of this joint right here. Boom, my man, Ream doing his thing. Hold it down for Houston, all right? Y'all come get some of that as well. Right here at BrinnyRadio.com. It's your man, Mr. Stout, on RenegadeRadio.com on the Skeen Beach Radio Music Review. Let's turn this one up. Come get some. I thought I was serious. Yeah. Yeah. 
I'm the type to call the comatose, savage boy, might set your throat. I'm not here to fucking joke. I came to conquer shit and have a toast. If you speak to me peacefully.